trophy. And so I think for Arsenal, it's slightly different than Liverpool, where these players have won it all. That's, they've that, seen it this all. is where I agree because Liverpool have, when they've been in a fight with with Pep, let's be honest, they've won battles. They've 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 won battles. They've not necessarily won the war. But as you said, they've got the champs. They've got the prem. They've got something. That's what Arsenal need to do. Yeah. Their players have done it. Their players are in their prime. We need to get something. I do want the. I don't mind the FA Cup. I would describe the champs as impossible. The prem is improbable. But why that is the has champs to, impossible? You never know in this life. Impossible. Like, I think it's impossible. Really? I think it's impossible. Why? I mean, naturally, it's not impossible. You're going to go out there and try and win, but when you've got the Real CJ, Madrid... I promise yeah. you, mm. in my lifetime, in all of our lifetimes, so many worse teams than this Arsenal team I, have won the I Champions League. But mm. my team Here's in Europe, what, 2012? Yeah. 2012? Yeah. My yeah. 2005? Arsenal, our lot 21? Arsenal, we don't get <laughs> yeah. that. Yeah. yeah. Sure, we yeah. don't get those type of European campaigns like Chelsea, especially... Why? With, Why is that? Because we just it feels like we have to be perfect. The closest we got to that was probably the 2006 Champions League final. We all saw, unfortunately, how that ended. I just believe we've kind of got to do what City have done in that you have to learn to win the Premier League. CJ, I'm not having that, that from you, man. I listen to your podcast and I see you talk with Chess and the way you're talking right now, you sound like a Spurs fan. It's impossible what, for us to Yeah. By the way, CJ, Life is impossible. We still go for it. No matter how bad it looks, no matter how statistically it looks impossible, you still go if for I it. If I get the odds up right now, you'll be one of the top three favourites. Yeah, that's the great. They said that season. last year. What happened? You know, you had Arsenal fans coming out here and saying, bring on Real Madrid. Impossible, I don't care. CJ. I think it's impossible, but go over it's and do impossible. it. Go over and do it. We're in the champs, try and win it. I think, as a fan, it is impossible for Arsenal Football Club to but win the Champions League. But can you explain why it's impossible, meaning you have no chance of winning it? I, I just don't think we can do it. I can't see. Do you want me to sit here and lie? I don't think we're going to win it. If it's we, another claim if, you, if we step into Every game, of course, I'm going to be filled with confidence. Of course, I want us to win. On the day, anybody can beat anyone. Can I sit here on, what's the date today? The 27th of October and say Arsenal are going to be in the Champions League final and, and, and win it. No, I can't see You're going to win the Premier League? I, we have to fight for it. We have to fight for it. So I guess That's in that case, you would take third you place take in third FA Cup. I did it, but again, so we're, going happens. Back in, <laughs> we're going back in circles. I said I wouldn't be against third place in the FA Cup. Two troops can live in one realm. It's not white or black. Are, are we not having a debate? Mm. I would not mind third place in the FA Cup. But after flirting with Manchester City for including this year, the last three years, for as much as Mikel Arteta is rated, for the money spent, for the partnerships, for maybe not so much this season, but the, the best defensive record and all of this stuff that we're doing, the Emirates rocking again, not the best of atmospheres. I want the Prem and I would love the Champions League. So why can't I be... If we was to... Let, let me finish. Yeah. If I was to be... Why can't I, on one hand, be cool if we finished third and won the FA Cup, but say I want more? I would be genuinely filled with happiness if we win the Prem. What we can't do is sit here and act like there's not two truths that can live in the same realm. It's not white or black. What would you take? What, what's your preference? The, FA, um, the Champions League or the Premier League? We ain't won the champs. I would love the champs. Over the Premier League? Oh, 100%. Oh, really? A million percent. Fair enough. A but million you, percent. And that, that's because you believe it's the impossible dream? Yeah. And I, we ain't done it. Well, like, Sam, As Abby said, we've been to the same amount of Champions League finals. Like, I want to win it. And you, I don't know how you can sit there as an Arsenal fan. You saw how close you got against Bayern Munich. You, saw, close. you, see, you see the variables in there. I've seen, in my lifetime, right, in 2012, how bad Chelsea were. Ryan Bertrand started the Champions League <laughs> final for Chelsea. Yeah, I saw you lot like, with it with Di like, Matteo, but it's, it's, we, it's mad. We, we won the Champions League three years ago. Yeah, but who were those players you had at the time? I know you said with Ryan Bertrand, did you not have Jogba? You had seasoned veterans. You had people around it. You had, I don't want to sound old school, but you had men. We've got people grow, growing on the job. Is You've this got, not Arsenal team full of men? It is full of men, but they're growing on the job. So yeah, you can do see. Do not it. think you're established enough at this point that yeah, you I should agree. be willing. You should be saying with chest. I believe that the money we spent, the team that we've assembled yeah, under Mikel Arteta, yeah, is now I, I capable so. and is, should be winning but this the is, league. This is what I said that I want the Prem. I want us to win the Premier League. I think we have we have something in us to challenge. We came to. You're, you're of, saying that they had more men, and I don't think that talking, Ryan no, no, that was, that, was that, in that was in reference to the Champions League, where I specifically said you had jog, but you had seasoned veterans. But don't you have enough veterans? We do have physic. We do have physically imposing players. How much more do you want? I, 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 How much a lot more, more, a lot more. If, if I could finish yes we do finish, we do have please. that it's not my fault Spurs <laughs> lost today you know it's genuinely not my fault Selhurst Park South London is scary what do you want me to do about that like chat to uh, Poster Cogley I'm trying I'm trying to find like, out why Kula says he came off to be honest yeah, with you I mean, that's what I'm wait, doing right now Shrubley should have taken Madison off in the 45th minute and you would have done better there was 50 minutes was crazy but from one unserious club to another yeah I can't even remember what you asked me now no, no, like, but, okay but my issue with the Champions League thing that you're saying I'm sorry to stick on this point is that when Liverpool won it in 2019, granted they got to the final the year before, but Salah hadn't won it before, Van Dijk hadn't won yeah, it before, you... Alisson hadn't won it before, they became world class off the, the back okay, of winning yeah. that. Look like, at the spine of my squad. Yeah. Uh, not individuals, yes, Kai Havertz has won it, Jorginho's done this. If they haven't won Prems, they've won champs. I mean, if they haven't won champs, they've won Prems, they've done or things. Or won like, Euros. Yeah, they've done collective things. 
Look at the spine of this club. You know what spine means. Yeah. Saliba, Gabriel, they're learning. They're even just establishing themselves on the international level. David Raya is just coming new into this sort of thing. Martin Odegaard's learning on the job. But Kyle Saka every year is learning on the job. Look at the spine, not individuals, the spine. And then go and look at the manager and then go and look at the people above. Where have it's almost like you're learning how it's almost like you're learning how to cook and you're having to burn your hand numerous times. But the way that people talk about Saliba is the same way that people talk about Van Dyke when he first came to Liverpool. He had ne- all Van Dyke had done is play for Southampton and play for Celtic. Yeah. He had- he hadn't won anything I'm happy, significant. Yeah, but what you can't do is underestimate playing in the Champions League. So, and I'm happy you mentioned Saliba because the one time in Saliba's career since he's properly been introduced to Arsenal, where I think he's looked a bit shy, has been in the Champions League. You go and look at Porto last season, etc., etc. And this is the realm we're in. So, yes, on one hand, if we finish third in FA, and, and in the FA Cup, if we zoom through him to May, I would say, all right, you could say face, maybe there's pressure on Mikel Arteta. But we know the Prems, the champs, the impossible. This is what needs to be done. Are we happy now? Two truths can live in one realm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's I, like, I just want you and Abby to make I, up. I feel like, I feel, I feel like Declan Rice at Anfield. There's like three against me. Like. <laughs> well, you know what? You guys can make up. But that's a very good idea. that, CJ, by the we, way? We could, we could talk about that. But I think Would you take go- that right now? No, because I think the goalposts will move with Arsenal. Uh, for me, I agree with you. Me, personally, as an Arsenal fan, if we turn around and win the FA Cup, what are they going to say? It's not the Prem, it's not the champs. Arteta still ain't got over the line. That's why I slightly disagree with Arsenal, but I think you're yeah, on the money. I, I, I'm surprised you think that's the money, season for Arsenal. If we go and finish and win the FA Cup, people are going to say it's still not the Prem, it's still not the but champs. But you still but have, the, you the, do but have to win trophies. We win trophies, not you Please stay out of the combo. Thank you. When last did you not win a trophy? Okay, first and foremost, I hate this lazy narrative, okay? I'm just going to put it out here now. Before we watch your team. What's the lazy narrative? that you can't talk on another team because of who you support. So that most people wouldn't be able to talk on anything unless you support Chelsea or Liverpool or United, really. I so we're going to do that. You support Spurs. So yeah, I'm, always, I'm always going to give. An, I'm always going to do that's, it. It's, it's a lazy you've got, narrative. You can and talk. I don't you've like got it. eyes. You've got TV. Yeah. So again, so we'll, we'll talk on fundamentally, it. Fundamentally, I'm an Arsenal I'm fan. For. The game's the game. I the game blood is the game. For it. Arsenal need to win a trophy. You can't keep dining off on the. I literally on the said we need to win a trophy. I literally just said if we do not win the Premier League, you're turning your nose up at the FA Cup. You're turning your nose up at the FA Cup. Forgive me. Don't ever tell me I'm turning up my nose to the FA Cup. No. Let's stick to exactly what I said. My team. My team and Man United have won the record times yeah. I said I like I like the FA Cup I simply said he asked me he said would third in the FA Cup be good for me personally I would take that I, And but right. I said the goalposts will change they will still say it's not the premise not the champs where did I say I don't want the FA Cup it sounded like no, you would say well, well we no, can't win I mean, that if you want to debate about trophies we can no, un- that's if, not you wanna, no, 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 no. if you want to debate about tro- you spoke can I if you want to if you want to speak about trophies in offense she's now speaking about Arsenal yeah no 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 but two truths but two truths no we've gone away from Spurs two truths can live in the same realm I never turned my nose up with the FA Cup the ambition is the Premier League but CJ if we were two would you take the FA Cup in third place right now and your answer was no because you've got bigger ambitions. I said for me personally, I would take. I said the goalposts will shift with the narrative in the media about us about us doing that. It won't. If we go and win the FA Cup, they will say it's still not the Premier, it's not the champ. You've spent 600, 700, 800 million. You've done this. You say Arteta is the best thing since sliced bread. He's the second best manager. Would you He's agree with that narrative third. though? Would you agree with that? If if you win the FA Cup and you finish third, but you don't win the Champions League or the Premier League, will you agree that that's an underwhelming season? Such a, such, such a, it? It's a double-edged sword because again, since Mikel Arteta won the FA Cup, we haven't really done anything else, and he's and I somewhat think that saved his job at the time because we were back to back eighth and whatnot. But it still wouldn't be the Prem or the Champs, the one that we want, the one that we've been on a twenty-plus year drought. That's what would, we're building I, up. I, for. I would agree. Mikel I would, Arteta I, six I, then I, says that himself. I would say if you say to me now, is that a good season for Arsenal? I, I'd say no, and I don't want to. Because I do think the FA Cup's great, but I do think where Arsenal are at right now, pushing City, pushing City last two seasons, Champions League quarterfinals. Hey, no mistake, I want I every part of silverware possible. 